What's up, guys? White Horse here. Just got back from Locals. Um, it is 12 o'clock. Yeah, 12 o'clock. Um, it's Thursday. In two days is regionals. Uh, I'm not really ready. Then again, I'm not playing. Um, for all you guys who are actually going there to play, good luck. Wanted to talk to you guys tonight. It's a uh, Road to Regionals episode four. Wanted to talk to you guys tonight about tier two decks. Okay, let's get into this. Um, I honestly think tier two might have a chance. Tier two, as in stuff like Fire Fist. Just because I don't think anybody has a side deck ready for that shit. And Mermel. Apparently, Mermel isn't the big three anymore. It's tier two now to everybody. Even with title, I don't know. Um, honestly, I think Mermels have a, an outstanding chance at this regional. I honestly believe they have an outstanding chance anywhere. I mean, hey, they've won like three, four YCSs now. Why wouldn't they? You know? Um, <clears throat> then again, dragons and spellbooks do exist. Evil swarms are a thing. So, you know, it's really hard to tell from this point right now um, what will either win slash top. Then again, I don't know. Topping, it's a little, it's a little, I guess you could say it's already sort of decided that dragons are going to top. Because dragons, come on, come on. There's not much you can do against dragons. It's dragons. Shit's annoying. Um, honestly, I feel like Mermills will do, you know, better than whatever I think they will. And if there's anybody out there playing Windups, Fire Fist, Macro Rabbit, I think one of those, like one copy of each of those might make top 32. Uh, and anybody, I'm going to go ahead and like say this, if anybody who gets top 32, I want a profile. I do. Last four regionals I've went to, I've got no deck profiles. That's bullcrap. I need this for my channel. A lot of people are keep keep on going on about, well, White Horse, why don't you ever, uh, why don't you ever get any regional deck profiles? You know, I got one. The guy didn't top. It was Mermels, but he didn't top, and I surprisingly did not get that many views on that uh, deck profile. Um, I need profiles, guys. I'd rather, honestly, I'd rather get. Three to four profiles as, as most as I can, as much as I can. I want to make them fast, but I don't want to make them, you know. I just won't. I don't know. Anyways, enough of that. Enough about what I want. Uh, this is about what you guys want. What you guys want to talk about. Uh, tier two. For anybody out there playing Fire Fist, I have faith in you. I honestly do. I honestly feel like nobody is going to have a side ready for that shit. Everybody's going to have a side for Mermails, E Dragons, and Spellbooks. Um, I mean, that's pretty much it. Just, oh, and Evil Swarm, and Evil Swarm. I forgot Evil Swarm. Uh, I knew I was forgetting something. Um, <clears throat> those four decks alone, everybody's either playing or playing one of one copy of each of those, because of course you can't play all four of them, that'd be crazy. Uh, they're playing either one of them or they're siding against all of them. Um, honestly, I feel like, don't go in there playing, like, a solid tier 2 deck like Agents, because uh, you won't, I mean, honestly, you could try to top, but there's a really good chance that you won't make it, just because of the fact that this format that we're in is so bad. Tier 2 decks are honestly not as good as they used to be anymore. Like Black Wings, uh, Infernities. I don't know why, but a bunch of people have been doing good with Infernities. I don't think Infernities stand a chance against Dragons, just because they don't use any spells or traps, so honestly, the Void Ogres are dead. Um, and the fact that they can go Big Eye and take your shit is pretty, like, pretty ruthless, so... It's pretty stupid. I mean, I don't know. Dragons, I just feel like could do a... do real. I think Dragons might even win this event, honestly, I do. Uh, I see dragons and some mermails in there. I'm I'm honestly not too sure about prophecy because I feel like prophecies can easily die, just to like stuff like eradicator, epidemic virus, and stuff like um, droll and logbird. I feel like that card's gonna be cited in everywhere. 
Um, and if I, I feel like if I get any profiles, honestly, I feel like I will see at least two to three of those in each person's side deck, not if not mained. Um, then uh, Mermel's, Mermel's Evil Swarms. Mermel's, I think, will make it. Evil Swarms, I don't. Just because I, I feel like a lot of people have been, a lot of people that I've seen been struggling lately with Ophion. Honestly, I felt like Ophion was legit their their win condition pretty much is they set on three back row go Ophion. Um but surprisingly that's not really the case. A lot of people's been losing with Evil Swarms against like dragons and prophecies and stuff just because I don't know, I I just feel like they don't know I don't feel like they can manage their stuff well. Not talking to anybody locally, like at my locals fanatics. I'm just talking about like people online on Dev Pro. Then again, I can't really say that that shit's like fair because you can't side at all. Um, so you know. Um. <clears throat> so yeah, just tell me what you guys think. I honestly feel like tier two, like Fire Fist and Mermail, might have a good chance at this regional. Especially Fire Fist. I just don't feel like anybody or wind ups. Oh my god. And or even um. I forgot. Wow, I just I just remembered. I forgot like the like the best probably tier two stuff. Gadgets, mud ultras, hoop cake, and uh, what's it? constellers? Oh my god, constellers! I want to talk about constellers. They are stupid. They are too good. They have a walking compulse and a freaking better like version of dragon charger or something like that. I don't know. Constellers are awesome. Uh, I feel like a lot of people is gonna be playing those decks. Um, I don't know. I mean, I just feel like Fire Fist are really going to do good. It's just a feeling. Then again, wh whoever doesn't play Fire Fist right now, um, sort of like if you don't have really that good of a deck, you should try playing, try investing in Fire Fist because the bears are like, from what I've heard, bears are going for like 30, 40 bucks. So, get on that, guys. Get on that. Um, I mean, really, that's much, that's much, that's, there's not much to say, really, about that. That's, that's as much as I can really tell you about how good, like, how, sort of, like, Fire Fist are sort of dying, but then again, they're not, they're not really, they weren't really a, how, I don't really know how to say it. All it was was sort of Tinky Bear, Tinky Bear, Tinky Bear, or Tiger King, that guy. Yeah, Tiger King, go Tinky, go Bear next turn, set up next play. <clears throat> I just don't feel like, I mean, it has to wait. And honestly, right now in Yu-Gi-Oh, it's like if you wait a turn, you die that turn. Because this format is so bad. Um, I just can't, I honestly just can't wait for the ban list time, ban list season. And I don't know, I just made that up. I feel like every time I say ban list season, I feel like it's like the month of the ban list, pretty much. Uh, everybody makes videos about ban lists, uh, ban list discussion, ban list predictions. I actually like ban lists, um, you know, ban list time because it just, I don't know, ban list season just sort of feels like, it's like the biggest time of Yu-Gi-Oh! Because everything that we've always, all, all the things that we've been through is just about to change. And we don't know how it's going to change until it act until we actually see it. Then again, some people predict right and some people predict definitely definitely not right um i honestly i predicted one right i said i think kalut might go to three and what happened kalut went to three uh i wanted black whirlwind to come back to two but it did so or i don't even think it was ever at two i think it was just one time at three and then one time at one which is now um <clears throat> slow wings is whatever i call some black wings i don't know i just don't really think they're really that good anymore um but yeah guys Again, this video is on Fire Fists or Mermels or Constellers, Madolchis, and Gadgets. Uh, surprisingly, a lot of Gadgets have been topping. Um, gadgets are crazy. Uh, if you guys can, you know, play that, play that. Or Machina. Like a straight Machina deck with Big Eye. I don't know. Anyways, I think I'm about to wrap this video up and then go to bed. I'm honestly really tired. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I want you guys to stay tuned for tomorrow, which is my last day, sadly, of my Road to Regionals, and then it's Regionals, baby. That's all I can really say. That's all I can think of. I'm going to try to get some videos of you guys at Regionals, 
and I'm gonna try to get me some deck profiles, some interviews. If I, you know, if I see anybody who I know, like Spoofy Twenty Nine, Lord Solar Prime, any anybody like that, um, or even Frankenberry One Two Three. Some of my friends, I might even, you know, do that for you guys. Um, I'm gonna try my best, you know, like if I get somebody like John Gill, that'd be amazing, or you know, Spoofy. Um, I'm gonna try to do my best for you guys at regionals as much as I can. Tuscaloosa was sort of bummy because they, I, I don't think they wanted really anybody recording there. So, anyways. Until tomorrow, guys, this is White Horse signing out. I want you guys to leave comments and shit like that. I'm not even going to go over all that. I'm going to just see you guys tomorrow, okay? Thanks for watching, guys. Peace.